Hello everyone. In the previous video, we have saw that uh, when the rate of depreciation is not mentioned in the question, how we have to calculate the depreciation by applying the formula. Now in this video, we are going to see our case number two, when the rate of depreciation is given in the question and we have to prepare asset account and depreciation account. So let's take one question. So this is the question we have, uh, K limited purchase a machine on 1st January 2015 for 40,000 and another machine purchased on 1st July 2015 for cash for same value. Limited charge, depreciation on machine at 10% per annum by straight line method and the books of K Limited ends on 31st December each year. Now the requirement is machinery account for 15, 16 and 17, three years we have to prepare and uh, depreciation on machine account we have to prepare. So I will advise you to take the screenshot of this question or uh, just uh, click the photo of this question. We are moving towards the solution part. Now first we are making the machine account. So I will write here 2015 and 1st uh, January. So first here bank account for our machine one machines are there so I am giving the name machine 1 40,000 after that same year on 1st July same bank account and we are going to give the name machine 2 same value 40,000 after this the year will end so same year 2015 31st of December balance carried down so for this machine 1 and machine 2 two machines are there 40,000 is the value of each machine total 80,000 books are closed for first year 80,000 both the sides after this uh, the next year will start that is 2016 1st January we are going to write balance brought down here same machine 1 and machine 2 that is 40,000 each machine 40,000 40,000 total 80,000 this side again the year will close because there is no new purchase of the machine so we are not making any entry on the debit side this year as well so 2016 closing on 31st of December again balance carried down machine 1 machine 2 values same 40 40,000 each machine so total value 80,000 after this uh, third 2017 here we write here first January again we can write balance uh, brought down first same machine 1 and machine 2 values are same 40-40,000 40, total account is closed this side Again write down 2017, 31st December, balance, carried down, machine 1, machine 2, same values, no change, 40-40,000. Changes will occur when there will be sale or when there will be any purchase of the asset. So now this machine account is 
done no change occurs because of no sale at purchase after this you have to create the second account that is your depreciation account so for this in the credit side we are going to note first depreciation which is charged on 2015 31st of December so we have to write here profit and loss account or income statement whatever you want so income statement now two machines are there so in the first machine that is M1 we will charge full year depreciation so in the M1 we charge full year depreciation 10% of 40,000 that is 4,000 and M2 we are going to charge for year 6 month depreciation only that is 2000 because the machine is purchased on 1st July 2015 so in the bracket you can mention 6 months only total depreciation will be 6000 then on the debit side you are going to write same date 2015 31st of December and balance carried down M1 M2 4000 2000 total depreciation 6000 books of first year closed after this second year will start so balance carried down in the debit side and brought down will be on the credit side so now 2016 1st January balance brought down same machine 1 machine 2 4000 2000 total 6000 then after this same date 31st of December 2016 when we have to chart depreciation again we have to write income statement now two machines are there we have to charge depreciation on both the machine now this year the depreciation on both the machine will be same this is state line method we know that the depreciation amount equals each year now in this case the depreciation amount will be 4000 for asset 2 as well so the amount is how much total 4 and 4 8000 so <clears throat> total if you will see this side 14,000 and here on the debit side 2016 31st of December balance carried down both the machines M1, M2. If you will see M1 depreciation, it will be 4000 plus 4000. Total is 8000. For M2, 2000 for first year plus 2000, uh, 4000 for second year. Total is 6000. And if you will see total, total is same 14000 after this last year we have to make that is our 2017 1st January we will write same thing balance brought down uh, space is less so M1 here and M2 both depreciation 8000 and uh, 6000 so 14000 is here then again same thing on 31st of December we will write here income statement M1 
M1 and M2 for 4000 right so that is 8000 now total of this and this side same 2017 31st of December balance carried down M1 M2 so how much total now this year again 4000 depreciation is charged so earlier in this machine we had 8000 plus 4000 this machine 6000 plus 4000 so now 8 and 4 this is 12000 6 and 4 this is 10000 total 22000 same here 22,000 so the depreciation account is also complete now next video we are going to see the cases when there will be disposal of asset and we have to make only two account that is depreciation account and asset account thanks for watching this one goodbye